This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes, creators of the world's best repair manuals. Fix your car or truck the right way with our accurate and reliable information at your side. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete online manual at Haynes.com. Rear shock absorbers replacement. Chalk the front wheels to prevent the vehicle from rolling. Loosen the rear wheel lug nuts, then raise the rear of the vehicle with a floor jack positioned under the subframe. Place the jack stands under the reinforced portion of the unibody seam, then lower the jack. Remove the rear wheels. Support the trailing arm with a floor jack. The jack must remain in this position throughout the entire procedure. Remove the shock absorber lower mounting bolt. Open the luggage compartment and pull back the carpet to reveal the shock upper mounting nut. While holding the shock damper shaft with a hex bit, use another wrench to remove the shock mounting nut. Pull the washer and bushing off as well. Remove the shock from the fender well. Place the lower bushing on top of the shock then install the shock absorber up into the fender well. Insert the bottom of the shock into the bracket on the trailing arm and install the bolt. Use the floor jack to raise the shock into the upper support. Install the upper bushing, washer, and nut, then tighten them in place. Tighten the upper mounting nut to the specified torque setting. Lay the carpeting back into place and close the trunk. Tighten the lower mounting bolt to the specified torque setting. Remove the floor jack. Repeat this procedure for the remaining rear shock absorber. Install the rear wheel and lug nuts. Raise the car with the floor jack, then pull the jack stands out and slowly lower the car and tighten the lug nuts to the specified torque setting. Remove the chalks from the front wheels.